Here's what it says in Proverbs 4, verses 1 and verse 2. Listen, children, to a father's instruction, and be attentive that you may gain insight. For I give you good precepts. Do not forsake my teaching. God speaks to you, and you know what you do? You listen. You follow. If you were to ask a question that you really, really wanted to know the answer to, you would naturally listen, and you'd give your full attention to that answer. So when you're praying for God's guidance and God's direction, you will give no less than 100% of your attention to the divine answer that you receive. Now let's be honest. Sometimes we pray for an answer and we don't like the answer. And sometimes we close our ears and our attention to the answer. I've done it. You have too. And when I've done it, it's uh, something that uh, eventually I saw that what I was doing wasn't working. And then finally I turned to God again to the original answer that I was given a long time ago. And, of course, it worked. It might just be that the answer which comes to you is not the kind that you're expecting or even wanting to hear. But you will be ready as you let your faith this time guide you. You will listen with your heart as well as your mind, and you will trust God. You'll know without any hesitation that God's wisdom is far greater than your own. God may speak to you as a whisper. God may speak to you as an idea. I call them divine ideas or a feeling. And you listen this time with your whole being and you become receptive to the guidance of God that works each and every time.